So about a year ago, Giga's Fickers made a full auto shotgun using Bestial Sling, and I wanted to see whether this build was still strong by making my own version, prioritizing damage over casting speed. So let's take a look. And the Great Sword, which I think can true combo, so I've got to be really careful. Because if that can true combo, I'm going to be in some trouble. 282, I love it. 141 as he's running away. Right, yeah, I've got to be careful here because I don't want to get true comboed, you know. That would be embarrassing. Oh, 564. I love how you can stagger people with that attack, with the bestial sting. This is so good for staggering. Oh, Storm Stomp, okay. So I've got to be careful of Storm Stomp because if I get hit by that, I'm going to be in some big trouble. Let's try trade. Oh, 260. Ah, oh, he rolled. But I didn't get hit, which is quite nice. Now look at him. Look at him trying to use, um, ooh, 216. Good fight. Yeah, that is actually really, really strong. I'm actually impressed with that. Let's do a few more. Right. We've got Bestial Sling, Golden Vow, and a Dream. And we're going up against Dil Bay. Or Dil B. Hey. With a Shamshir. And the same armor that I have, although I can't remember what this one's called. It's like the Drake Scale, I think. Oh no, I used the wrong. Oh no. I used the wrong attack for a second there. Ooh. 690. Yeah, I need to avoid getting staggered. I also need to be careful because the hitboxes on weapons are extremely jank if you don't dodge. Like that. Like you might try to backpedal away from an opponent and you'll still get hit because um, of the way it works. Oh. Oh. Oh, 106. He was playing it way too aggressively because he knew what I was going to do. He knew I was going to be charged, but a good fight. Right, going up against Sakari. With some interesting drip going on. Big belly, iron casa, beast champion leggings by the looks of it. So let's go in. Oh my god, this person just got caught in every direction. Oh, we got poked in the face. He's, the game has been evened. Dude, what? Does this person not know? <laughs> Wait, what's going on? Dude, you should dodge. Oh, okay, Flaming Strike. Thank you for giving me a chance to heal or to recover my mana. Oh my god. Dude, they do not expect the stagger. This just stops people in their tracks. It's beautiful. Good fight. Right, let's get our buff on. CPU Hard AI. Am I going up against an AI right now? Is that what this is? This chat GPT against my enemy. Let me see if I can... Ooh, 230. Nice. Nice. Yeah, he's got the curved club that the Albanurics use. My people. Oh my god, please. Oh. Get him. Get him. Get him. He's going to run out of stamina eventually. <laughs> what the hell was that? I think we both ran out of stamina at like the exact same time, probably. Wait, what? What happened there? I thought I dodged it. Recover. Oh my god, he tried to slap me across the face. Okay, he's getting aggressive. Oh, he came in with a jumping attack. 200. Oh, 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 oh. He's trying to slap me so hard. Oh. Oh my god, please stop slapping me in the face. Please stop slapping me. I beg. I beg, stop slapping me. <laughs> oh. Oh, and I dodged a bit too late. <laughs> oh my god. My one weakness, a tiny dagger. Right, going up against 2022. Let's get our golden vow on. This person's got the cross naginata with. Wait, is that crag blade? Crag blade. Oh, let's go. 260, 520, F780, 1040, 5000, and 2,134. Apparently, that's how many hits it will take to defeat a person in Fall Tree Sentinel at point blank. He doesn't know how to dodge, so good fight. <laughs> right, we are going up against Elden Lich. This person's going to start spamming Swarm of Flies. I can already smell it. 
I can smell the swarm of flies coming off this person. Or maybe not. Maybe it's going to use Morgoth's Curse Sword instead. Yep, there we go. Oh, wait, I got hit by that, but he didn't get hit by my... Oh, and there's a swarm of flies. There it is. There it is. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yeah, you better start chugging that. Whoa. Whoa, 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 bro. What? 137? Okay. Bro. Bro, just back up a little bit, please. <laughs> You're taking more damage than I am. Oh, punished at 137. If I can keep punishing that attack, you should be in a good position. Oh my god, I hate the hitboxes on that so much. Yeah, okay, we need to back away and recover our stamina. Because we are taking some serious punishment right now. Two hundred and seventy-four. I love it. Beautiful, beautiful. You thought your weapon skill was going to carry you, did you? Nope, not today. Good fight. Right, we are going up against Arch Saint Noma. He's got the Banished Knight halberd. He just buffed himself with something. Oh, and triple rings of light. See, I'm going to have no sympathy for this person when I absolutely whoop his ass. Take your freezing pot somewhere else. Get out of my face. With your triple rings of Radagon. Get out of here. No, I don't care. I don't care about your triple rings of Radagon. Get out of here. <laughs> I, love how my, I love how I tanked it as well. I just took it straight to the face. Good fight. Right, going up against Eustace Baggy. Or Bag? Eustace Baggy? I don't know. But he's got the Godfrey Axe, so I've got to be really careful of that stomp attack that he's going to do. Yep, there it is. Wait, can I... Can I punish that? I might be able to punish that. Hang on. Oh, right out of the sky. Oh. Wait, can I oh can I stagger him when he does it? No, I can't trade it. Ah. Oh, it makes sense that he can't trade that. But the fact that Ah oh, come on. Yeah, it makes sense that he can't trade that because it would it'd be kind of insane if Beastial Sting could trade Godfrey's axe. But then again, I have traded some pretty insane stuff. <laughs> we got another person here who doesn't know how to dodge. Like, come on. He's trying to trade with me by the looks of it. Oh, 29. Okay, let's let's take it easy. Recover that stamina. Oh, 58. He thought he could block it, but that's that chip damage. Good fight. Right, we are going up against Felka. He's using... Oh, I thought it was Black Flame Blade for a second now. I was getting a bit worried. Let's give him a quick wave. Cool. Sacred Blade, not a problem. Beast your sling, 292, not bad. Oh wow, he actually managed to... Oh, yeah see I noticed that if you hit him point blank with the Beast your sling, that's when it will stagger them. Opportunity to recover, nice, 266. Oh, oh, 266, oh okay, let's not get too greedy. 532. Oh, 166. Yes, yeah, so we got to hit him point blank in the chest with a shotgun. And that's how we sagger them. Good fight. Right, going up against Severian Ordovis. I don't know if this is like a lore inspired build or if this is something else, but. Oh. Yeah, and also, when players attack you quicker than your attack comes out. That's when you know you're in trouble because, oh, punished. Punished again. He's not going to heal, is he? Oh, I caught him in his back just as he was trying to run. Good fight. Right, going up against Kaladin. And that reminds me, I want to use a... Um, I want to make a Destined Death build utilizing the Black Greatsword or the, what is it called again? Malachus Greatsword? Something like that. 
<laughs> well, that'd be actually quite fun. Because it's a decent weapon. Oh, snap. I was wondering what the hell he was doing for a second there. Um, yeah, let me get behind him. Cool. If I had a stronger weapon, I'd be able to punish him so much at that moment. Oh, and I got chipped. But, I mean, he's taken some serious punishment from that. So, a good opportunity for me to finish this off. Oh, 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 the punishment. Yeah, 77. Yeah, sorry, but I managed to tank through most of that effortlessly. Good fight. So I think my verdict on this build is that it's still extremely strong against the right type of enemy. If you're going up against people who are super aggressive and in your face, then you might struggle. But if you're going up against people who have some distance and you can sort of get off the bestial sling before they attack, then you send a pretty good chance. So I'm just trying to... Oh, you're in trouble now, aren't you? Yeah. No, actually, he's, he's faking it out. Is he faking it out? Oh, okay, no, we're both out. But yeah, no, it's a really, really good build still. Um, and what I like about it as well is that you can stagger people out of their attacks with the bestial sling. So I could bestial sling this person for 318 damage and sort of stagger them out of their attack before they can land. And this is really good for trading.